Wildfires can be horrible things to experience. They wreak havoc on landscapes, homes, and lives. They devastate habitats, endanger wildlife, and pose significant threats to human safety. But did you know there are people who get paid to start fires on purpose? Prescribed burns, also known as controlled burns, are carefully planned fires conducted under specific weather conditions. These intentional fires are set and managed by trained professionals to achieve ecological and land management objectives. Fire teams across the country use the tool of prescribed fire to help restore and strengthen natural plant communities and protect communities from catastrophic wildfire. It's much like a doctor uses medication to treat an ailment. If all prescriptive parameters within the fire plan are met, such as wind, relative humidity, temperature, weather, and fuel conditions, the fire can be started. But what about the animals that are in the fire zone? While fire may seem dangerous and destructive to wildlife, many species, both plants and animals, need fire to maintain healthy habitats. The animals may seem most vulnerable to the flames in a prescribed burn, but the burns are planned in a way to minimize danger. Burn sites are often divided into smaller plots with some land left unburned, providing a place for wildlife to go. In addition, prescribed burns are typically planned, so they do not coincide with mating and nesting seasons. Very few injuries or mortalities occur during burns, with most animals able to escape the danger. Deer and many other mammals can run from the flames, while birds can simply fly away. Other animals, such as mice, snakes, and lizards, can burrow underground to escape fire. After the fire is out, you will notice many birds return to the area to take advantage of the cleared spaces. Eventually, native plants will once again start growing and fill in the areas. Be sure to check out the description section for more information.